Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Lucky Corners in the Soviet Resources uh, Republic with the uh, workers. Right, okay. I have no idea what I was doing last time. Um, it probably involved uh, logistics and Resource Central and moving stuff around. Uh, yeah, it probably did. Right, anyway, before I get uh, too far down the road for this episode, I do want to just mention quickly, if you're watching this as it comes out, uh, I've dropped down to one episode per week. Uh, I'm kind of burning out on uh, workers and resources, so uh, I'm going to uh, slow down a bit. Um, I may be back with it uh, after the 1.0 release, and you know after i finish you know some tweaking of some stuff here and uh you know i uh, i may be back after the 1.0 uh and i'll be coming back with a a new republic uh you know greenfield uh fresh uh operation right uh so anyway uh enough of that uh right hmm So, uh, I need to take a look at uh, what I'm collecting into Resource Central. Where did Resource Central go? It's over here. Okay. So, what am I collecting into here? I have uh, clothes and nothing else coming into here just yet. Uh, okay. Um, I do want electronics. I want everything to come into here, but, um, electronics and, uh, uh, yeah, electronics for sure. Um, and I have a meat storage. Yeah, I want meat to come into here as well. Okay. So I need to get all of this coming into here. Now, uh, here's my, my collector business here. So we're collecting from... No, we're on... No. Uh, no. Uh, we're... Um, Collecting from uh, here, which it was giving us clothes, right? And we are theoretically collecting from here, right? Which will give us electronics. Okay, that's where we're at. So here we've got... And we've got to actually build electronics. What are we... Uh, we're kind of short on workers, actually. Yeah. Anyway, we need... Components, plastics... Okay... Okay... Let's, um, let's let uh, time roll on here. Uh, we are producing, no, we're producing electronics at a rate that's useful. Uh, how much do we store here? 24. And... Yeah, okay... You are going where? Iron Town. Well, I suppose I should probably change those to Yeah, no, I, I don't know. Hmm. You know what? 
I think it might be better to try and uh, and just produce create a new location producing things and bring those to resource central yeah yeah maybe I don't know um, over here yeah so we've got plenty of chemicals so yeah Okay, so let's uh, pick on the electronics chain, right? Uh, so this needs uh, mechanical components. So we are... That's electrical components. This is plastics. Right. Okay. This is mechanical components. Okay, mechanical components. I've got lots of them building up here. Okay. I can take those to the central warehouse. Ah. Okay. So we'll come over here to our Dewey here. Uh, we'll check in here. Yeah, we do have them enabled. Okay. So, we can come up here. Um, no, it's up here. Yeah. Okay. And with this... Uh, right. So we can bring that down. And hopefully that will uh, bring a train up here reasonably quickly. Um, Um, okay, so this guy. Yeah, okay. Unemployment too high, happiness too low, right. Right, now, um, source. Um, yeah, we'll make sure it's 10%. Yep. And, oh yeah, we want to unload them here. And, no, we don't need to specify. Uh-huh. But do I need different, do I need, like, flat cars? Um... Cargo, um, box car. That's a refrigerator. That's a box car. I need more box cars. Okay. What are you? An eleven two eighty. That's one of them. Okay, so we've added some box cars, right? Um, yeah. Now here, we have vehicles on the way. Right. You know what we can do? We can follow this guy. Let's do first person. 
Yeah, we haven't done a first-person uh, rail ride in a minute. So let's just see how ridiculous this uh, travel is uh, and whether it makes sense to make a uh, shortcut line. Well, you know what? This actually... actually looks pretty uh, pretty decent overall. Uh, I've commented before uh, on graphics on these things, but the graphics in the game here is actually pretty good overall. Oh look, we found our branch point. Yeah. Well, okay, so the idea is I'll get the... Uh, uh, the mechanical components going to Resource Central, right? And then I'll uh, set things up so that uh, the uh, source of them at Irontown comes from Resource Central. Uh, and that'll be one commodity that's shifted over. And that's kind of, I think, how we need to do it, right? Yeah, I don't think there's any other reasonable way that we can do it. Uh, talk about a ridiculous uh, rail operation, eh? Just a little bit ridiculous. But come to think of it, uh, rail operations in real life can be just this ridiculous. And we don't have a huge amount of traffic uh, coming along this way, so... Uh, look at that. We're uh, collecting uh, mechanical components. And off we go. Now, we can, we can finish with that. We don't need to do any more of that. Um, but, uh, this is also going to, yeah, so we're going to basically wipe this out, uh, and then this guy will, uh, just, you know, keep doing what it's doing. Um, yeah, okay. So, if we... Okay, let's just uh, go check in on this happiness business here. Uh, the happiness is 42%. Huh. wonder why. Uh, well, that's the thing, right? Uh, there's... A little bit too much um, lack of information all around in the game, so it's it's hard to identify the actual problem. Now, from a role play perspective, that's kind of accurate, right? When you when you really get down to it, but uh, you know, it's uh, it's still uh, you know. Uh, realism can sometimes be a little bit of a uh, downer when you're just um, uh, playing a game, right? Uh, you, you know, you're, you're playing games to kind of escape from uh, reality, right? Unless it's a job or something like that. But, you know, most people playing games, it's not a job, right? So, yeah, uh, that's uh, kind of the way things, uh, things roll. And it looks like we have uh, the uh, the um, uh, mechanical components starting to arrive here. We certainly have uh, a 
tiny train. Yeah, so they're they're arriving, and we have uh, you know 650 tons in here, right? So that will uh, that will build up. Uh, so this guy, nope. This guy's the distribution guy. Uh Okay, let's uh let's head on back up to Iron Town over here. Right. So here so this is train distribution office. Right. So now I can go in here. I can add a delivery. And we can go here and we can unload those. Yeah. Okay. Now, Iron Town Logistics Operations. Hmm. Iron Town Warehouse. Aha. Yeah, we'll take that out. Okay. Good. That's now got uh, the mechanical components coming in here are now going via the central uh, central depot, right? And that uh, that's one one more thing that uh, that doesn't need to uh, doesn't need to be modified right um, right okay uh, so there's that now plastics we're producing Hmm. Yeah, that's not so... Electrical components, they need plastics and steel. Uh, and chemicals. Right. Uh, yeah, electro components need to, need to probably go through that way as well. Uh, oh, we got a building there without a power supply. That's fine. Uh, here, electro components. Yeah, because we're producing them there. Huh. You know what? I do still want to collect them uh, centrally. So. We'll go in here. Right. Uh, and we are collecting from, this is Irontown South. Right. 
cargo train station. Yep. Um, no. Okay, now we want to load at Irontown South Cargo Train Station. And we'll load those. Okay. Okay, so we'll start collecting those. So we're loading mechanical components. Right, okay. You know, I think I need to put a... Uh, set of signals in the middle here if only uh, if only to improve throughput yeah uh, okay um Okay, that is definitely doing its thing. How are these doing? They're empty. You know what? We should be harvesting up here soon. Um, soon, yeah. Okay, well, citizens' happiness is still too low somewhere. Uh, right. Uh, okay, well, uh, that's basically the logistics thing. Uh, it needs to bed in a bit more and, uh, uh, you know, get to the point where stuff is collecting. Right? Um, in here. Uh, you know, the more... The more stuff collects in here, the... Uh, uh, the easier it is to fan stuff out to new locations, right? So that's the idea here with this whole resource central idea, is that it's a central location where all the resources come into when they're produced, and then they can be fed out to where they're needed. Now it works, it should work great with anything that's uh, non-perishable, right? Uh, you know, shelf-stable stuff like rocks, you know, that sort of thing. Yeah, uh, but anyway, uh, you know what, I'm going to put the cut here. Uh, we've uh, wandered around the map and poked and prodded at things, probably enough to uh, uh, enough for the, the week. Uh, next week, I might have something, uh, something almost interesting to do. Probably not, but I might. Uh, so maybe you can you come back and check it out. Anyway, uh, I do have a Patreon if you want to support the channel. You'll find the link in the description. You know, you, where you often find links. Uh, and, you know, uh, if not, well, you can ignore that link. It'll still be in the description. And you can also uh, like, comment, subscribe. You know, the whole YouTube business that I should probably mention at the beginning and the middle of the video instead of now. But I mention it now anyway. Uh, but, of course, you can just not do that too. You know, entirely up to you. Anyway, uh, all that said, see you back next time.